Hello and welcome to the Lusail Stadium, just about 10 miles to the north of Doha here in Qatar. I'm Derek Ray and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. And it is a first test for these two countries here at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. It's the Korea Republic up against Portugal. Well, thanks, Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. And the South Korea starting 11. Well, the two wide players are great in 1v1 situations. And their movement is also very good. But it's the midfield three that will need to control the flow of the game. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Rui Patricio begins in goal. Joao Cancelo starts with Rafael Guerrero as fullbacks. Ruben Neves plays alongside Bruno Fernandes in central midfield. And leading the line today is Cristiano Ronaldo. And now they get the ball rolling. And good use of advantage, the referee allowing play to continue. It's a neat move, and with that, the attack fizzles out. Chance to do damage, but really sticking to the task defensively. Well, prior to the last 20 years, Portugal were infrequent visitors to the World Cup. Hang on, Cup. Derek, what a chance this is. And a goal it is! No long wait for the opener today. Well, here it is again, and I have to say, the defending is so poor. They make so many bad decisions there. No wonder the keeper's exposed. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Oh, number seven, Cristiano Ronaldo. Juan Uijo, and he's won the ball. Ronaldo. And Lee Jae Sung with it. Over the top intended for Son. Very quick thinking there. Son. Son. Tremendous block. Son. The cross is on. And that was a very fine read. Rafael Leao. Bruno Fernandes has it. And skill for them to produce something exciting. Applying vigorous pressure. They've gone and scored again. 
They're doing everything in their power to make sure they're not pegged back. Well, here's the replay, and he's got to clear his lines there. He doesn't do that. He has his pocket picked, and he's been rightly punished. Poor defending. moving again Wang plenty of forward momentum here but can they produce Son oh surely and a close offside decision as they were threatening Well, it's been difficult for the Portuguese to get hold of the ball, but when they have won it back in midfield areas, their counter-attacking has been excellent. They'll be happy with the way the game's going at the moment. And the threat on the counter-attack is very real. Here they come again. Ronaldo. Well, sloppy in possession. Leal. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. So one minute of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. That is that for the first half here. Well, no doubt about it, Bruno Fernandes bringing his considerable influence. And now they get the ball rolling. And the ball rolling again after what was a dizzying first 45 from Portugal, you've got to say. Can they match that performance in this half? Might really be able to trouble them here. He has time to play it over. Now well, nothing comes of it. An important interception. Kim Young-won. Making high pressing work for them here. Now the attack will peter out. Keeper's ball. Oh, a perfectly timed pass. Well, let's look at this again. To pick out this pass shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect. And then it's a wonderful strike from Son. He hits it with power, he hits it with pace, and he hits it with accuracy. What a goal that is. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the scoreline. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. Ruben Neves. Well, not hard to read that pass. Lee Jae Sung. And teammates around him. Well, let's see about the cross. And a time for calm on the ball. Son. Convert didn't fall the keeper. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. And over it comes. And a struggle to get it away properly. 
And not quite accurate enough, Stuart. Well, I think he should do better there, but at least they're now knocking at the door. Fernandes not a good place to win it back and let's see what it leads to useful looking ball Fernandes takes the shot couldn't quite hang on well what an opportunity but really good defending you've got to say now we're inside the final 10 minutes in this one showing a willingness to attack as they must given the circumstances time running out but it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending Otavio and Bernardo Silva has it this could finish it and in all likelihood that is game over so little time left for a response Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. Well, that's a tale of four goals in this match now. 3-1 it is. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have two extra minutes. Wang Hee Chan. Jung. And the referee says that will do it. It is a win for Portugal, just what they were hoping for.